this is all I gotta say to you. Wow, we, uh, we've got quite a hardened person here. OMG, guys, aren't we so happy to not talk about Andrew for once? It's been like three videos. Okay, but objectively looking at it, I'm not entirely sure if talking about Jupiter is better or worse. But yeah, considering it's been like four months since I've talked about Jupiter, I may as well give everyone here a refresher. Jupiter is a 25-year-old man who, uh, claims he's a vampire and a werewolf. I wish I was making this up. He also claims that he's made homunculi out of his stuffed animals. He said he was married to his Twilight Sparkle plushie. <clears throat> Excuse me, I mean Sheratora. That was her name. I hate the fact that I know that. And he has also been caught on multiple occasions talking to cupcakes, as I'm going to refer to them. Not only that, he's also said some pretty concerning things, and he's also proved that he knows what he's doing. Not to mention the fact that he said that he knows many places to bury bodies in Idaho. I'm not even kidding, he legitimately said that. I can make those people disappear. There's places out here in Idaho where I can bury bodies and no one would think to look. Yeah. That smirk! See, I told you. But yeah, ever since those four months that I covered him, things just got a lot wilder. Linda Binda interviewed his sister. Jupiter did an interview with Smokey and Kiwi, shockingly. Jupiter defended his brother who went to jail for the same thing that he did. Jupiter tried leaving the internet only for him to come back. This happened like five times or something like that. Jupiter was so on and off with Linda that it got to the point where he threatened her. Also, he's trying to fight the hacker group Anonymous because for some reason he thinks that they're working with Linda. Oh yeah, and he got caught another few times talking to Cupcakes. So there's that, he never learned. You motherfuckers never learn! What the fuck?! Real talk, it's so annoying. Like, it costs zero dollars to not do that, but you do it anyway? <sighs> okay, all of that aside, we're gonna get into the actual video now, I promise. Right, so you know how Jupiter basically accused Linda Binda of working with Anonymous? The reason why is because she's been exposing him? Like I said before, she interviewed his sister, and he did not like that. Oh no, he did not like that one bit. And you know, because of that and the other stuff that she's catalogs, he made a video where it's just him threatening her. And you know, since Linda's clearly a troll and she's been cataloging everything, of course she'd upload this to her channel. And that is going to be the first video that we watch today, my friends. Without further ado, let's play the video. Hey Linda, I'm declaring war. Oh, we're starting out strong already. On you, bitch. <laughs> You can tell Homeboy is trying so hard to be tough, like we- You're not wearing a shirt! We're not gonna take you seriously! Also, your hair is greasy! Fix that! I thought mine was bad! Then again, my hair's like three feet long, but goddamn, I've never had my hair as bad as yours! So get ready for this crazy meth tep addict is what you think I am, or a child pr I am. That's cause you are one! There's mountains on top of mountains of evidence showing that you've done that! Also, didn't you claim that you were high on nicotine because you were smoking when you were talking to the cupcakes? Also, not to mention that after that, you were caught again, like, a good few times, so I don't want to hear it. Get ready for war, bitch. I'm a Mandalorian. <laughs> what? Bro showed his necklace and went, oh, I'm a Mandalorian. This isn't Star Wars! Is it from Star Wars? I don't know. I may not show it, but in spirit, I am. This is the way that I always do things. What, claim that you're gonna stop doing it and then do it again, and then also threaten people? Which I wanna say, mind you, direct threats are not protected under the First Amendment. Sure, I might look crazy with my hair right now. Yeah, you do, and I think it's because you need to shower. But I don't care. Because you don't like to shower? You shouldn't talk shit. Shouldn't be talking shit to people like me. Oh, what are you gonna do? Have Lucifer talk through you again like you did with Smokey and Kiwi? Oh yeah, that happened by the way. That was an actual thing. Again, can't make this shit up. No matter how hard I try, I could not make this shit up. Otherwise, pay the price. Pay to play, bitch. Oh, oh, that was almost a direct threat. Oh, oh, you are treading deep waters, bestie. Screw you and your entire crew. You honestly think I give a damn. You clearly do. You're making this video. You clearly do. Not anymore, bitch. You're making this video. You made these videos talking to her about this and chewing her out. Of course you care. People who really don't care don't do this. So come at me with all the ferocity you got. This werepire is done playing games. <laughs> See, 
I told you guys that he claimed that he was this vampire werewolf creature. I told you. I have people watching you. You honestly think that I wouldn't have people watching your ass right now. Uh, oh, you're getting closer to making direct threats with every word you say. Just shut the fuck up. Man, if you ever got lawyers, I'd feel so bad for them. They would fucking hate you for that. You honestly think I wasn't watching, that I didn't know what you were attempting to do, playing insurgent. <clears throat> Please, bitch. That was such a fake chortle, I swear to God. It sounded like he was trying to cuff up phlegm. For those of you who are squeamish to that, I'm so sorry, but you know I'm right. I put down what Rebellion's worse than you. Oh, and, uh, Linda. Just because I don't post often doesn't mean I'm not watching. Oh, okay? That just means you're a lurker. Like, you're not special for that. You're not special. You see, people like you often victimize people like me. What? No! No! <laughs> people like us don't victimize people like you. We expose you for the pieces of shit that you are. We did not make you talk to cupcakes. We did not make you claim that you were high on nicotine and that was why you talked to them. We did not make you go back to talking to them afterward. We did not make you say that you know where to bury bodies in the state of Idaho. Oh, and we also didn't make you say that your darkest fantasy was to off everyone who's wronged you in Minecraft. Just saying. Make us look like idiots. No, you, you did that to yourself. Well, in this day and age, that might have gotten away. What? No! No! We got away with exposing you for what you are, which is a potential offender of some sort. Whether it be with cupcakes or whether it be, you know, trying to off somebody in Minecraft. But I'm done. Everyone will see you for the fraud you really are. No, Jupiter, everyone sees you for the weirdo that you are, for the offender that you are. Which, by the way, that was all you're doing. Linda Benda was the person who just brought you to light. You were the jester and you played your part showing your foolery to everybody. This was my escape from my realities. I am done playing your game, bitch. Find a new victim. I'm out. What? Bro, you are so wild for that one. You think you're a goddess. You think you're all this and that. When did she ever say that? I don't remember her ever saying that type of shit, dude. I know that you were part of Anonymous. I have some friends in pretty high places. <laughs> I'm sorry. Every time that, like, gets me. Who know exactly who you are? Oh, and if you ever try to make a move or make a j dash from where you live, I have agents posted around your house ready to put a bullet in your head. That's a direct threat. That's a direct threat. That is not protected under the First Amendment. That's a direct threat. He, he can get arrested for that. Linda, if you're somehow watching this, please press charges. You can charge him for this. I hope you know this. So go ahead. Try to run or fight back. People I have contact with will put a bullet in you and call it good. Like, I know his threats are empty, but you can legitimately press charges against him for this. Please do. I beg of you. Please do. Because honestly, I could care less if you lived or died at this point. Do I really need to say it again? That is a direct threat. <laughs> I could care less. You honestly think I'm going to play the victim? Well, you did before you threatened her. That I'm going to play my part in society. I'm, I'm sorry, what is Blood Waffling on about with that last part? Like, with your part in society? What did you do? Sit there and smoke and talk to cupcakes? People like you don't understand the societal woes of people like me. Bro, really? Just went, oh, you think I'm going to play the victim? And then he proceeds to do it! Like, what are you doing? I came from a working class family. Jupiter, my family is probably lower than working class, and I know not to talk to cupcakes. And I also know not to threaten people. We worked for what we had. Okay, so did I. Again, I know not to threaten people, and I know not to talk to cupcakes, especially in that way. Like, I'm not saying that my childhood was worse or better than Jupiter's. We both have our own trauma, and that's whatever. But at least I was raised to know not to talk to minors in that way, and not to threaten people. It's so shrimple. And you honestly think I'm gonna let you get away with slandering me? What slander? There's evidence! In order to prove defamation, you have to prove that they were knowingly making false claims. But the thing is, Jupiter, we have 
oodles of evidence against you, proving that we are right. Really? Princess dipshit? Excuse me, I'm the princess here. It's in my username. Slash J slash J. People like you don't deserve friends like me. Uh, but you guys were never friends? She was there to catalog you, and she ended up finding out that you talked to Cupcakes. Again, she never asked you to do that. Find a new target. I'm done. You can piss off. Okay, that's cool. I'm actually kind of sick of hearing you, not gonna lie. And yeah, that's the end of the video. I'm sorry this one was shorter, but I, I just can't take listening to this man for more than like five minutes. I'm sorry. If you want to see the full version of whatever the fuck this was, I'm gonna leave the link to that in the description, as well as Smoking Man Correct's video. In his video, he plays the interview where he and Kiwi interviewed him, and oh my god, it's actually fucking insane. Like I said earlier, Jupiter claimed that Lucifer was talking through him. Oh yeah, and apparently the full interview was four hours long. I might watch that in a stream at some point. I don't know. That would actually be pretty fun to do. And that's it. That's the end of the video. If you guys liked it, give it a like, comment your thoughts down below. Please subscribe. And that's it. See you guys later.